Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, where we discuss important financial matters and government assistance programs that affect Canadian seniors. Today, I have some exciting news to share with you, especially if you're a Canadian senior receiving the Old Age Security OAS pension. Prime Minister Justin Trudeau has recently signed a new bill that will provide a one-time double payment to OS recipients. This means that eligible seniors in Canada will receive not only their regular OS payment but also an additional lump sum payment this week. This is a significant financial boost for many seniors who may be struggling to make ends meet in the current economic climate. In this video, we'll dive deep into the details of this new bill, understand the eligibility criteria, and explore how you can claim your double payments this week if you qualify. In response to the ongoing economic challenges faced by many Canadian seniors, the federal government has introduced a new bill that provides a one-time double payment to OAS recipients. This bill was recently signed into law by Prime Minister Justin Trudeau, paving the way for eligible seniors to receive substantial financial assistance. Under this new legislation, eligible OS recipients will receive a double payment consisting of two separate amounts. A. $2,400 lump sum payment. This is a one-time lump sum payment of $2,400 that will be added to your regular OS payment this week. This payment is intended to help cover essential expenses and ensure that seniors have access to the resources they need during these challenging times. The $2,400 lump sum payment is a significant amount that can make a real difference for many seniors. It can be used to pay for rent or mortgage payments, cover medical expenses, purchase groceries, or address any other pressing financial needs. B. $1,900 additional payment. In addition to the $2,400 lump sum payment, eligible seniors will also receive an additional $1,900 payment. This payment is meant to provide further financial support and ensure that seniors can maintain their standard of living during the current economic climate. Combined with the lump sum payment, this additional $1,900 payment brings the total one-time double payment to a substantial $4,300 for eligible OS recipients. How to claim your double payments if you are an eligible OAS recipient, the process of claiming your double payments is straightforward. The government has implemented measures to ensure that the payments are delivered to you automatically without the need for additional paperwork or applications. Here's how you can claim your double payments. A. Check your bank account or mailbox. The double payments will be issued directly to you through the same method you receive your regular OS pension payments. If you have direct deposits set up, the funds will be deposited into your bank account. If you receive your OAS payments by mail, you will receive a check or direct deposit form in the mail. B. Payment dates. The double payments are scheduled to be issued this week. Depending on your specific payment cycle, you should receive your regular OAS payment along with the additional $2,400 lump sum and $1,900 payments. It's important to note that payment dates may vary slightly based on your location and payment method. However, the government has assured that all eligible seniors will receive their double payments by the end of this week. C. Monitor your accounts and statements. Once you receive your double payments, be sure to carefully monitor your bank accounts or financial statements to ensure that the correct amounts have been deposited or received. If you notice any discrepancies or have concerns, you can contact the government's designated helpline for assistance. Using your double payments wisely. With a substantial one-time double payment of $4,300, it's essential to plan and budget carefully to ensure that these funds are used effectively to improve your financial well-being. Here are some tips on how to make the most of your double payments. The primary purpose of these double payments is to help seniors cover their essential expenses, such as housing costs, utilities, groceries, and medical bills. Prioritize using a portion of the funds to ensure that your basic needs are met and that you can maintain a decent standard of living. If you have outstanding debts, such as credit card balances or loans, consider using a portion of the double payments to pay them off or reduce your debt load. This can help alleviate financial stress and improve your overall financial situation. Setting aside a portion of the double payments in an emergency fund can provide a safety net for unexpected expenses or emergencies that may arise in the future. Having a financial cushion can help you navigate challenging times without compromising your basic needs. Consider using some of the funds to invest in your health and well-being. This could include paying for medical treatments, purchasing necessary equipment or assistive devices, or participating in activities that promote physical and mental wellness. If you're unsure about how to best allocate your double payments, 
consider seeking advice from a qualified financial advisor or a trusted financial institution. They can provide personalized guidance based on your specific circumstances and financial goals. Additional support for Canadian seniors. While the one-time double payment under the new OA's bill is a significant step in providing financial relief to Canadian seniors, it's important to remember that there are other programs and resources available to support your well-being. A. Guaranteed Income Supplement GIs The Guaranteed Income Supplement GIs is an additional monthly non-taxable benefit provided by the Government of Canada to low-income OA's recipients. If your income is below a certain threshold, you may be eligible for the GIs, which can help supplement your overall retirement income. B. Provincial and Territorial Assistance Programs Many provinces and territories in Canada offer additional assistance programs specifically designed for seniors. These programs can provide benefits such as subsidized housing, healthcare coverage, tax credits, and other forms of financial support. C. Community Resources and Support Services in addition to government programs, there are various community-based resources and support services available to seniors. These can include meal delivery services, transportation assistance, home care support, and social activities organized by local organizations or community centers. D. Seeking help and information. If you are unsure about the programs and resources available to you or need assistance navigating the application processes, don't hesitate to seek help. Contact your local seniors' organizations, community centers, or government helplines for guidance and support. The one-time double payment under the new OA's bill signed by Prime Minister Justin Trudeau is a significant financial boost for eligible Canadian seniors. With a potential $4,300 in additional funds, seniors can better address their essential needs, pay off debts, and maintain their quality of life during these challenging economic times. Remember, if you are an eligible OAA's recipient, be sure to check your bank account or mailbox this week for these double payments. Monitor your accounts carefully and ensure that the correct amounts have been received. While this one-time payment is a welcome relief, it's important to continue exploring and taking advantage of other government programs and community resources available to support Canadian seniors. By combining these various forms of assistance, you can better secure your financial well-being. To be eligible for the one-time double payment under the new bill, you must meet the following criteria. A you must be currently receiving the old age security OAS pension. B. Your individual income must be below the maximum threshold set by the government. For the 2023 tax year, the individual income threshold is $137,389. It's important to note that the double payment is intended to provide financial relief to low- and middle-income seniors. If your individual income exceeds the threshold, you may not be eligible for the full double payment or any payment at all. While the one-time double payment from the OAS bill provides immediate financial relief, it's important to also consider your long-term financial security. Here are some strategies to help you plan for the future. A. Understand your retirement income sources. Take a comprehensive look at all your retirement income sources, including the OAS pension, Canada Pension Plan CPP benefits, workplace pensions and personal savings or investments. Evaluate how these sources will support your expenses and lifestyle in the coming years. Consider seeking professional advice from a financial planner or advisor who specializes in retirement income planning. They can help you develop a customized strategy to optimize your income streams, manage your assets and plan for potential future expenses or contingencies. As you approach your later years, it's crucial to have a well-structured estate plan in place. This includes creating or updating your will, designating powers of attorney for financial and healthcare decisions, and considering strategies to minimize taxes and preserve your legacy for your loved ones. In recognition of the financial challenges faced by many Canadian seniors, especially during the current economic climate, the federal government introduced legislation to provide a one-time double payment to old-age security OAS recipients. This initiative was spearheaded by Prime Minister Justin Trudeau and his Liberal government. The legislative process for this bill began with extensive consultations and discussions within the government and with stakeholders, including seniors' advocacy groups and policy experts. After carefully considering the potential impact and feasibility of the proposed double payment, the government drafted the bill and introduced it in the House of Commons. The bill went through the standard legislative process, which included multiple readings, debates and committee reviews in both the House of Commons and the Senate. During this process, members of Parliament and Senators had the opportunity to scrutinize the bill, propose amendments, 
and engage in constructive discussions to ensure that the proposed measures were comprehensive, fair, and aligned with the needs of Canadian seniors. After rigorous deliberations and revisions, the bill garnered widespread support from both the governing party and opposition parties, recognizing the urgent need to provide financial relief to seniors during these challenging times. Finally, on insert date, Prime Minister Justin Trudeau formally signed the bill into law, officially enacting the one-time double payment for eligible OS recipients. The signing ceremony was attended by key government officials, including the Minister of Seniors and other cabinet members, as well as representatives from seniors' organizations and advocacy groups. During the ceremony, Prime Minister Trudeau emphasized the importance of supporting Canadian seniors and ensuring their financial security, especially in the face of rising. With his signature, the Prime Minister officially brought into force the provisions of the bill, paving the way for the distribution of the double payments to eligible OAS recipients across the country. Over the past few years, seniors in Canada have experienced a significant increase in the cost of living, with expenses such as housing, food and healthcare rising at a faster rate than their fixed incomes. This has placed a significant financial burden on many seniors, making it increasingly difficult for them to maintain their standard of living and meet their basic needs. Global economic uncertainties, including fluctuations in financial markets, inflation and potential recessions, have the potential to significantly impact the financial security of seniors. Many rely on fixed incomes and have limited opportunities to supplement their retirement savings, making them particularly vulnerable to economic downturns. Despite the existence of government support programs like the OAAs and the Guaranteed Income Supplement GIs, a significant number of Canadian seniors continue to live in poverty or experience financial hardship. The double payment aims to provide immediate relief and help lift some seniors out of poverty, promoting greater financial stability and dignity in their later years. For many seniors, the ability to age in their own homes and communities is a priority. However, this can be challenging due to the high costs associated with housing, home maintenance, and potential care needs. The double payment can help seniors cover these expenses, enabling them to remain independent and maintain their desired quality of life. The government recognizes the immense contributions that seniors have made to society throughout their lives. By providing financial support through initiatives like the OAS Double Payment, the government aims to uphold principles of intergenerational equity and ensure that seniors can enjoy a dignified retirement after years of hard work and contribution. During the ceremony, Prime Minister Trudeau delivered remarks highlighting the importance of supporting Canadian seniors and the rationale behind the government's decision to provide this one-time financial relief. In his speech, the Prime Minister acknowledged the significant contributions that seniors have made to building and shaping Canada throughout their lives, he emphasized that it is the government's responsibility to ensure that seniors can age with dignity, respect, and financial security. Trudeau stated, Our seniors have worked tirelessly to make Canada the prosperous nation it is today. They have raised families, built communities, and contributed to our economy in countless ways. It is only fitting that we provide them with the support they need in their later years, especially during these challenging economic times. The Prime Minister also recognized the unique challenges faced by seniors such as rising costs of living, healthcare expenses, and the impact of economic uncertainties on fixed incomes. He emphasized that the double payment was a tangible step towards alleviating these financial pressures and improving the quality of life for Canadian seniors. This one-time double payment is not just a financial boost, it's a symbol of our commitment to ensuring that no senior in Canada is left behind Trudeau stated. It's a recognition of the sacrifices and hard work of our elders, and a promise that we will continue to support them as they navigate their retirement years. The Prime Minister's remarks were met with applause from attendees, many of whom expressed gratitude and relief at the As Canadian seniors, you have played a vital role in shaping the fabric of our society, and your continued engagement and advocacy are essential for ensuring a better future for all. By staying informed, participating in policy discussions, fostering intergenerational connections, and sharing your wisdom, you can actively contribute to creating a more inclusive, supportive, and remember, your voices, experiences, and actions have the power to create positive change. Embrace the opportunities to advocate for your rights, build supportive communities, and leave a lasting legacy for those who will follow in your footsteps. Together, we can create a future where all Canadian seniors can age with dignity, respect, and the support they deserve.